Good morning, guys. Today we are going to hit a desert reservoir. Hopefully, catch some monster fish. First, let's go check out our pontoon boats that we are going to be using on the lake. Uh, this blue one is mine. We totally customized this. This part right here is a motor mount for that to clamp on and for my feet. And then and that's a 30 pound thrust in Coda. And back here, we've customized this also to put the battery on here, not the battery and the motor because it's way too heavy, heavy. So we have leveled this out and it sets perfect. So hopefully this will work out for us and uh, I'll see you on the ride there. Bumpy road, but we're getting it done. Pontoon boats it got really dusty. See, that's the normal color. Made it. <laughs> yep, bumpy road. Alright, let's go catch some fish. Hey guys, we're out on the lake. Haven't got any bites yet, but been out here probably for about 20 minutes. And, um, beautiful day. And, uh, so yeah, let's see we can get a fish on the fly rod. First one on. I just put a new fly on. <laughs> Half hour of fishing and put on a Prince Nymph and I right, get him in, he's not too big. He's a little fighter, but he's starting to give up. See what you got there. Little trout, right? He jumped. I saw him jump. There he is. Not a bad one. Oh, little, yeah. little eater. <laughs> you got another little guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> a little eight, eight, nine inches. Second They're one. fun to catch. Yeah. Grandpa just caught a. I just caught a couple of those, but where is he? He's way over there. He kind of just runs his own show. He caught a nice 18 inch. It was a good fight. Let's let him go. Oh yeah, let him go. We'll keep one of those for a little fry up. Perfect. All right, Bryce got another one. He had a good little hit there and jumped. Is he a little one? Oh, maybe he's small. Got a little bit to him, maybe? Or just kind of a fighter? Probably six. You think he's that big? Yeah. Oh, he's taking a line. Let's see here. Bring him up a little bit. Oh, cool. Oh, oh yeah, you got a nice fish. Nice, buddy. I can I just saw a flash of him. Careful, you got your. <laughs> it's a nice, decent fish. Yeah. I see that. yeah, he takes some line there. He doesn't want to give up. 
I gotta see him. <laughs> He's, they're pretty fat sometimes this time of year. On a, what'd you catch at Prince Nymph? Nice. Grandpa, I got it figured out. I could not catch anything on a leech batter. Not gonna, yeah, get your net. I think he, you can get him in there. Yeah, you got you got eight pound line on there. I think you're okay. Oh, yeah, don't lose your fly either. Funny how he didn't fight till the end. Huh? That's a dandy, bud. Those are fun. All right. Let me, uh... Hey, that makes the trip right there, huh? <laughs> Better than a bunch of little 10 inches. All right. I'll let you take him, and then we'll get a picture of him. All right. Here we go. Finally. Got one like Bryson did here. Let's see. He has jumped about 15 times. Oh. Let's see if we. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bryce. Bryson's got a little one on right now, I think. He's just yell yelling behind me. This guy will not come in. I. He's coming right at me before. Let's see what they're doing. There's Bryce. Grandpa. Alright, I gotta get my GoPro out because it is hard to hold your phone. Alright, I'll get you a shot of this in a minute. Finally got her in. Looks about the same size, about 18 or so. Good fight. Looks like Bryson's trying to get one off of his line. This little spot right here is good. I was off an inch. Bryson got me by an inch. We got a 17 here. All right, we're gonna let this one go. Come on, little buddy. Good day, huh? Yeah, it's beautiful out here. Oh my gosh, this is a gorgeous country. Thought we saw a rattler. Love the high big, desert. Big yeah. Yeah. So we could have done a snake cook. Yeah. We had a couple of years ago. We had a good snake. Yeah. They're kind of bony, but. another day and I want to clarify one thing um, it, my fish was not 20 inches uh, so we measured it and it was 18 so anyway let's get the fire going and all I'm going to use is cotton ball and a flint and steel so with your cotton balls you have to pull them apart 
falling apart. And once we get that going, then we're going to put that, then this, then that, then that. faster than just using a lighter. And we'll put that on. We'll have to just put that on right now. And so you just want that to go just a little bit. Alright. So while that's maturing, I'm going to come over here. And when I get our appetizer, for our appetizer we're going to be using the liver and then inside here we still have the heart right there so that's what we're going to be using for that and just to get ready for the fish I am just going to cut the head off Backbone. Sometimes those fins are hard to get through. Then just go sideways like this. Perfect. Okay. So when that gets heated up, um, then we're gonna put her put the appetizer on and see how they taste. Okay, guys. For our appetizer, we're just gonna add a little garlic and onion. So first, I'm just gonna. That's as much as we need, and we're gonna save this to stuff in the trout and just cut this little pieces the garlic smash it just as much, much as we, we're going to use and we'll use that to season the trout also and our heart and liver on here, and so we put it on the cast iron. Oh yeah, perfect. That'll be done really quickly. So um, we'll see you when take it off and have a taste test. Took it off the fire, and it looks phenomenal. Uh, first, we're just gonna put some lemon juice on there. Not on the onions, but then a little, just a little bit of salt. And so, okay, let's try the heart out first. Looks pretty good. I knew that was gonna be good. <laughs> it looked so good. Okay, let's try some onions with a piece of liver. helps with the onion it is oh, for a second it's perfectly cooked mm. have to do it with lemon so to kill fishiness okay so next we are going to do the trout and stuff it all right so I've already put butter in there and then like I said put some garlic just for flavor we don't have to eat it as much onion as you can if you have a little bit uh, uh, a little bit like a too like too much then you can just put it on the fire okay that's perfect and get some salt and that is perfect and now we've got the frying pan heated up Perfect. It's been about um, about five ten minutes. 
on each side. And um, I think this pup is ready. Oh yeah. Oh, man. All right. Now let's flip this puppy, actually. Oh, falling apart. Just pull away that skin. Yep, oh, got a little bit of meat off of there already. But lemon and salt. Oh yeah, lemon. Salt. So. Don't skip on the lemon. Actually, that tailpiece looks good. It does. I got a piece. Right, let's see what you think. This one with no lemon or anything on it. Oh, that part was. Mm. That's one of the best fish I've had. Mmm. Yeah. Tastes mm. of smoke from the fire. Mm-hmm. Mm. Not too bony. Just a couple. This time of year, they're so pink. Yeah. Flaky. Good That's stuff. A success. Well, guys. Anyways, um, thank you guys for watching this video. Please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know whenever I upload, and that's usually Saturdays or Sundays. And so I'll see you on the next one.